Yo, what's up, guys? Today, we are doing the patron's request. And we are watching Ben 10. And if you want to make us watch things against our will, check out our Patreon and vote in the Patreon poll. Precisely, Core. And if you guys want us to watch more Ben 10, then get this video to 15,000 likes and uh, subscribe. Yo, is that spaceship manufactured by Bad Dragon or something? <laughs> they're gonna they're gonna make Ben 10 for adults. They gotta do so that you switch the wristwatch and it changes into a different shape. Oh wait, hold up, you're <laughs> cooking right now. Dude, this is just like Danny in. Phantom, and that the main song just explains the fucking series. I mean, that's like the intro to every cartoon from before 2010. Normally we take your money and beat you up. Oh my goodness, this is Eden and Jack coming to beat me up. Leave him alone. Dude, he's so cool. This is so stupid. Okay, now I remember why this show is like so cringy in retrospect. This show's cringy? Ben never loses. This kid like just takes dubs back to back and he doesn't deserve them. Like he's so egotistical and up his own ass and it sucks. I think- uh, He's kind of allowed to be. He just- He's fucking OP. He just the- uh... Geek. Jerk. Something tells me it's gonna be a long summer. He has such a, like a slow cadence to the way he speaks that it's relaxing. Like it makes you just want to jump in his lap and kiss. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Wait, hold on. I'm just kidding. I don't even. I don't know what that. Wait. So is Gwen Ben's sister or Gia? <laughs> <laughs> Who said that? Yes. The answer is yes. Who wants to roast marshmallows? There's something about the look in his, his eyes that is like kind of unsettling. Yeah, he's a fucking evil, sinister child born from the season of Satan. Whoa, a shooting star. I could really use a wish right now. Oh my goodness. Is Ben Mordecai in Gwen's Twilight Sparkle? How? In any way, how? <laughs> how do you... The fucking UI is the funniest fucking shit ever, dude. Do you think Ben 10 was like one of those shows where they designed the toys first um, and then made the show like after? You know what? I could see what you mean because like a lot of the forms are like incredibly simple. Wait, stop. This is me. If I had the Omni Matrix, I'd go to Canada and do this instantly, bro. Allegedly, hypothetically, in Minecraft. Darn fool camper out there messing around with something he shouldn't. Ben. Ben. He's got such a bod. He had two fire extinguishers just at the ready. I don't know what you are, but you'll stay down there if you know what's good for you. Ow! He's gonna kill his sister. How are you like not- This is a primordial fucking biblical proportion alien being, and you are only mildly surprised at its presence initially. It's me, Grandpa. Ben? Even if you knew it was Ben, how are you not freaking the fuck out? They are surprisingly burn. chill about this. Backfire. Start a new fire and let it burn into the old fire. They'll snuff each other out. Does that work? If Grandpa said it, it's true. Like It feels insane, but it's so insane that it seems like it must be real. Think he's gonna stay a monster forever? He's not a monster. He's an alien. He's not a monster. How do you how do you know this? I mean, he is a monster. What the fuck is the distinction anyways? I'm me again. <laughs> Oh, too bad. I liked you better when you were a briquette. What does that mean? Like the roasting stuff? What fucking like 11 year old knows the word briquette is? How, that's how so many people learned the word briquette. They learned it from this show. Oh, it's like Aglet with Phineas and Ferb. Yeah. I think like half of my vocabulary just came from reading Calvin and Hobbes. This is fucking horrifying. He did this so quickly. Like he just had an extremely traumatic experience and then it's like, yeah, let's run that back one more time. Another one. This thing's even uglier than you are normally. How wow, put a flea collar on this mutt. Bro, she's coming out here doing her tight five. Gwen is so fucking funny as a character because she takes L's so the boys watching this series could be like, hell yeah, dude. Girls drool, boys rule. It is very crazy to think that in a lot of other series in this scenario, he would be like struggling with his powers at first. Ben is just the most naturally gifted motherfucker on the planet. Well, were you paying attention to the opening theme? He's got superpowers. He's no ordinary kid. With a device as powerful as that watch clamped on you, my guess is we better help you learn fast. Yeah, the like, grandpa just feels evil. Like he feels like an evil person.
Yeah. I feel like he has bad people in his life. The grandpa is not concerned for his safety. He could be getting crazy space cancer from this shit. Maybe like every single time he transforms, it takes 10 years off of his life. Like, they don't know that. Looks like Papa Robot this time. Dude, how many voice actors do you think they needed for Ben? Like, 45 or something? Oh, they already had, like, a 45-year-old woman voicing him. If he gets his arm torn off as the crystal, dude, when he transforms back, is he just missing an arm? That would be fucking awesome. I'm just like, this is the first fucking episode of the show. Look at his the use of his powers. He's a god. He's a god amongst men, frame one. Failure. Unbelievable. Do you guys think this guy is evil? Be honest and leave your theory down below. Well, he looks evil, but he bays in piss, which is good. Ben? Are they gonna show like all 10 transformations in the first episode? No, they don't, they don't. This is gonna be the best summer ever. Absolutely. It's definitely going to be interesting. You just have to say something. It's definitely going to be interesting. What are you adding to the conversation? Also, Gwen said interesting. Everybody says interesting, interesting. Exactly, and that's why we should kill her. She's a nerd. They literally no played the way. play. No fucking no way, way they played that. Oh. No <laughs> fucking way. I cannot take this seriously at all after hearing that. I'm here to help. How is him turning into the fire guy gonna help with this situation? Can you imagine your house is burning down? You're like suffocating inside with your child and a man made out of fire comes to the rescue. I'm not following that guy, are you insane? I'm gonna assume I'm hallucinating or something and I'm about to see the other side. No way, a gold sumo slammer card. He just absorbed the fire dumbass. That doesn't make any fucking sense. Why didn't he just do that in the fucking forest then last fucking episode? Dude, their grandpa's a fed. Now that I know they live in Washington, D.C., their grandpa's a fed. Well, I hate to say it, but, uh, well, we're probably never watching this show ever again. When we said, like, how does he know that it's an alien? Everybody in chat was like, no spoilers, dude, no spoilers, don't spoil. So that means he's in on it. You punks picked the wrong day to be bad. Hey! It's just a kid. So does he get his ass kicked now? <clears throat> so what controls how much time he has, Core? Do you know? It's a very good question. Everybody in the chat just says the plot. Whenever it's convenient for him to run out of time, that's it. Yo, Animo, I know you're in there. Open up. The background art is so like heavily textured. Yeah, it looks like they put in like a noise filter in <laughs> yeah. Photoshop. All my funds go into my research. Now get out! Listen, Doc, you and your furry friends are out on the street. So is the landlord supposed to be the good guy? Always is. Always is. Oh, always. Yeah. I forgot Core is really big on landlord TikTok. Why does anybody tip their landlord? Like, they do so much work for you. This is my transmodulator. Phase number one. Transmodulator. Phase number one. I inject <laughs> HRT into my body. Or that's not how it works. <laughs> I said that wrong. <laughs> Wait a second. Gotcha. What are you doing? Uh, looking for the gold sumo slammer card. That's so funny. I love the voice filter they have on that one. It's actually like low-key kind of adorable. It's making him sound like Invader Zim. Sumo slammer cards, a complete set. Let's check out the pet department. Let's check out the pet. That's only something a federal agent would say. Oh, let's check out the pet department. What is that code for? Is this like some pro steroids propaganda? Like the watch just has steroids. Like every time he pumps the watch, it just like juices him up with some steroids. We got a grab and dash in electronics. Trust me, you can't miss him. How are you in the same store and you can't hear? How big is this store? This store must be fucking absurdly large. The fucking roof and walls have caved in on the other side of the store and you can't hear it. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna lie. When I rewatched the show, I didn't make it this far. You only watched one episode. I thought I watched like five episodes. I only watched one episode. Yeah, it so. felt like five episodes. That is not, is not a very good sign. You saved the store. If there's anything I can do to repay you, anything you want. Who gives a fuck, bro? Just charge the insurance up the I'm surprised anyone is still in the store. Why did no one evacuate? It is kind of surreal because the store's so empty. There's like not a single soul here. Core, we live in a recession, man. This is Washington, D.C., man. They don't even have the right to vote in this country. <laughs> Being a hero isn't about others knowing you did something good. 
It's about you knowing you did something good. Yay, lesson. He's like Uncle Ben if like Uncle Ben didn't die, which is like, that's like the best part of his character is when he died. Something tells me we're on the right track. Holy shit, that's fucking horrifying. What animal is that? We all know about you and your freakazoid experiments, Dr. Animo. It's over. We don't like you, Dr. Anime. <laughs> we don't like anime. Oh my goodness, this is the anime fan. He's oppressed. He's finally rising up. Uh, does this guy come with subtitles? He literally said, um, does this guy come with subtitles? Why? Because he's anime and Ben 10 only watches the sub. Ben 10 goes to Japan and he's like, where's the subtitle? You guys get animal. I'll take care of Jumbo. Bro, that, when that shit beeps, it's like, it sounds like my fucking car is going off. It's like I'm locking my car. It's got that beautiful, like, when you leave the Ford car door open and it does that little jingle. How is she? Like, she's 10 years old, right? I think she's older than Ben. I'm just like, the muscle capability, it's pretty limited. Yeah, but she probably, like, canonically took karate classes, which explains everything. Spend a summer with your grandpa, honey. It'll be an adventure. That was a weirdly cinematic shot right there, where it like slowly panned away from her. Ew. Kind of well animated, but ew. Yo, we went there! Oh yeah, to see the big p Yeah, editor, put a picture on, on the- Put a picture of the big c on screen. Like it would have killed the founding fathers to install an elevator. Isn't there an elevator in there? Or maybe that's like a new thing. Uh, I don't think so. Because I remember walking up it. That's how you know grandpa's a fed. Fed theory number 3,442, bro. No normal grown man can climb that many stairs. <laughs> R. Kelly Industries? Oh no, dude. That, this, is that the is that the piss bottle? <laughs> this is the bottle with the piss that I uh, utilize in uh, my daily activities. Somebody help me! Help! Help! Help me! Oh my goodness, he learned he had to give up the cool card he wanted to save the day. He's learning! That's so me when I kill a dinosaur with my primordial ooze. He just sneezed on the dinosaur and that saved the day. That's really surprisingly well animated. Like a lot of this stuff is. It's pretty janky, but like they're definitely like trying to do more stuff with that, which I appreciate. Yeah, it's very ambitious. Knock it off, midget. <laughs> call him a midget. <laughs> Wait, hold on, I, I need hold the on. Ben 10 edit where she just calls him slurs like all the time. That's just Swamp Thing. That's what thing? You mean the Loch Ness monster? No, Swamp Thing character. A monster in the lake. How dumb can you be? How dumb can you be? No flipping way, dude. No flipping way that that just happened. Do you think Ben 10 would have- Does he have, like, an identity crisis when he turns 11? I mean, he's, it's funny because he's an animated character, but he's still experiencing the same trauma that, like, child actors exhibit, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's like you get the worst of both worlds with Ben 10. Actually, they do a Ben 10 reboot, but he's, like, 35, and the doctors tell him that he has 10 years left to live. Yo! Why does it actually go kind of <laughs> hard, though? Giant Blake monster! Hello, current events, you already got me with that one. No, this episode pissed me off. Okay, no, I actually do remember this episode. Why the fuck do they not believe Ben? Yeah, this is kind of crazy. It's a boy who cried wolf thing, but like it doesn't really make any sense in context. I understand that it's a boy who cried wolf scenario, but at the same time, in a normal scenario with boy who cried wolf, it's like, oh, he's always bullshitting. Ben tends not completely bullshitting. They've clearly seen scenarios in which there's actually been trouble, right? Captain Shaw? Who wants to know? This guy's not evil, though. He's fake evil. He's the red herring. He's wearing a red hat. That symbolizes the color of the herring. And he's hairy. That thing's not taking me by surprise this time. Why does he raise his eyebrows? Why is grandpa so Yas Queen? Is, does grandpa have, like, is there a grandma in his life? I am Jonah Melville, the founder of Friends of Fish. We've closed this section of the lake for an environmental study. PETA? Are these guys the villains of the episode? F fuckers of fish. How many times does that doofus think I'm gonna fall for this? That monster looks pretty cool. 
Did you see that last frame? She literally flew like 30 feet <laughs> into the sky fucking instantly. And you're right. The monster design, pretty cool looking. It looks cooler than any of Ben's fucking forms. That's for sure. Except for number eight. I fuck with number eight. I don't even, what does number eight look like? Hold on. I'm, I'm gonna Google number eight to make sure I got the right one. <laughs> What about number nine? No, not number eight. I think maybe I was thinking about number six. Chat, which one's the one that kind of looks like a big cuddly panda? That's 11? Oh, fuck it's off. It's not even in the first 10. That's fuck off. Did you just like tickle him and he got like, he got a little like nervous? What's so important in that crate that you risk your life for it? Um, our lunch. You almost got munched for a few Munched. Seconds. That boy is a munch. Oh, it's, it's going to be like the monster's baby. Oh yeah, you're probably right. Come on, Ben. What did you do? Fall in? Why is he wearing like the goo- the grandpa is wearing like a 10 year old's pajamas right now. Like what is this? He's wearing like a lightning bolt pajamas. How old are you? Only one way to flush her out with a little live bait. Maybe I should go with you. Another perfect moment. Another perfect moment to put the MAGA hat right there. Wish me luck. That's so funny. That's so fucking convenient that there just so happens to be <laughs> another set of equipment completely set up for him to put on. That was cr like, why did he do that? He literally full sent a harpoon gun at Ben. That was so un irresponsible on both of their parts. Don't you know night diving is dangerous, old timer? I haven't done anything worth stealing either. Okay, look, I understand that the fish people were gonna be evil. How are they this evil? <laughs> this is insane. Nothing, same as always. A Johnny Test whip crack when he punched him. This is an action scene. Yep. This is most definitely an action scene. Look at that. He's slurping his way up. I don't like this form. This is the worst form. It's so gross. Almost there. That's so funny, dude. The goddamn thing just turns off whenever it's convenient for the plot. Oh, they fell so far. I did not realize how high they were in the air. Why was he flying so high up? He knew his power was running up and he didn't like try and go closer to the ground at all. It's because he's 10 years old and it doesn't matter. Ben 10 always wins, okay? I did a little checking on Friends of Fish and found out it's not listening. Her eyes, her eyes from Whoa. one frame there were Yeah, I saw that. Unaligned. You look really fucked up. Let's go. I have a spare boat down at the docks. I feel like it's funny because this show is janky in a lot of wa similar ways to how, like, Naruto is janky. Like, when the faces are just, like, slightly fucked up a lot of the time. Oh, 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 ah! oh that's vile. That was disgusting. Ah, like, that my eyes! That's Joe Biden's testicles, by the way. Oh my god, because they need to clone him again. Joe Biden's testicles are big, bro. I want them, dude. I want them in my, my mouth. No! No! no Joe Biden's testicles! No! We need those testicles! No! Get them back right now! All right, buddy. We can do this the easy way or the hard way. Dude, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. If someone was pointing a gun to me and I was behind grandpa, I would feel like very safe. There's no way a bullet is getting through that guy. I mean, yeah, he's, he's pretty large. There's a lot to go through. My eggs! They are your eggs. But like, would you make an omelet with Joe Biden's stuff? Well, you know what I mean? You gotta crack a couple Joe Biden <laughs> to make an omelet. That's actually <laughs> the full expression. It was lost of time, lost of translation, but that's the original way to say it. Dude, imagining that these are tentacles have made this seem like 400 times funnier. Well, bro. they're like, they're like veiny too. Like they're veiny. They are veiny. Why are they veiny? This show holds up. This show honestly holds up. Like it's going to have some of its weird like mistakes here and there, but it's fucking TV weekly animation. Like this shit is pretty top tier for TV weekly animation. No, man, if I was 10, I'd be like, this is the best thing I've ever seen in my life. Hang here for a while until the police find a nice dry cell for you.
Would he get arrested? I don't know. I guess if this guy bears witness. Well, what did he actually do? Trespassing? But I could have sworn. Gas lighting at its finest. This old man's gonna think he has dementia now. Great fucking job, guys. Mm, Joe Biden tackles, I'm so happy. I'm an alien. And if you guys would be happy with Joe Biden's tackles too, then head over to Patreon and give us money. Bye! Alejandro Paredes, Atomic Leon, Bento, Kane Rivers, Kamalu, Cosmic Dega, Crystal Bunny, Daryl Herb, Diane Stalk, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Granado, Gub Stargazer, Gummy Brain Rot, Gunny Snow Unison, Helio, I Pigged Red Hand, Isaiah Alford, Kamui, Catherine Wright, Night VDV, Leaf, Lilac Moon, My Artistry, Master Nate, Matthew Byers, Mowry, Solomon Graber, Native, Nick, Obama Gaming, Omega Waffles, Pitch and Witch, Him is Best Boy, Rain, Steven Sanchez, Sunny D, Tyrant Sills, Toast, Ultimate Parson, Bell Explicit, Victoria, Wyatt Lyme.